hello welcome back to another video on my thoughts on the current comic market i just shot a video um on my latest cgc haul and how surprised i was that a value tier submission not fast track took three weeks to get done unheard of okay unheard of for those that <laughs> submit book to cgc even last year even last year value tier can take up to three months yeah months not three weeks so it surprised the heck out of me so I did some digging I can't wait to update the data at the end of the month and keep going on the side for my own number geekiness I keep track of how many books are submitted by people at CGC on a monthly basis in all different tiers and different age I get if you want to play around with the database yourself I can put a link below I mentioned about this site multiple times over the past many years on YouTube cgcdata.com okay you can go there and do all kind of fun queries to look at the census anyhow so after i shot the video i went there real quickly and did some digging and guess what i will put a link below as well on a video that i shot back on mid february of 2020 mid february of 2020 before the pandemic blew up and we have closure and lockdown no more conventions all that stuff before all of that okay i, I did a, a video on the census and the submission rate to cgc the link is below and i talk about how the slowing market the declining price of the market in 2019 did not slow down the submission okay the data prove it if you watch that video you see it i show a lot of data but just today minutes ago i went and checked and as of june 23rd we still have one more week left we are looking at potentially the lowest submission at cgc since something like march or april of 2019 i'm gonna slide in some image that i show how many books are submitted to cgc on a monthly basis over the past year and a half and as you can see holy cow even as of april and may of 2020 the number was still blowing up there was certainly a disconnect between what's going on with the pandemic the economy and what people was doing okay i'm sure there is a reasonable expectation or explanation a lot of people need money so maybe they rush to submit a lot of books in order to sell that's possible right who knows i did not okay if you know me you follow my channel certainly the amount of cgc haul that you see my my buying slowed down last year and come down to a trickle this year and my submission also slowed down because i bought less but that's just me as always you know me i always trying to preach to people that don't look at yourself as the market you are not the market i'm not the market how i behave how i do things is not the market okay you gotta step back and look at how the market behave and see the bigger picture than just your own personal situation or preferences okay so yeah it is not a surprise that submission is weaker so far in the first three weeks of june compared to the previous year plus right so it makes sense the fast turnaround huge surprise i'm not going to complain about it but it's definitely a slow down trend okay we have one week left okay we are not gonna break the number of april and may 
<laughs> not the 60, not the 70,000 submission when right now, the, the month to date submission is below 40,000. We're not going to make up 30,000 books in the last week of June. But I will update and let people know down the road on what's going on in June as I keep up with what's going on with the market. Now, why is submission down so much? Could be a couple reasons, no doubt. No conventions is a huge contributor, right? You know how CGC as well as CBCS love to go to the convention in May and June and July and August, right? Those four months, that's when things are really slow at CGC because they double dipping, okay? They're taking in submission, but they're not even grading them because they're too busy at the convention every week, sometimes attending two conventions a week, right? So yeah, that's the past. Right now, it's the current and we don't have the convention, so it makes sense, okay? It makes a lot of sense. There's a reason why, you know, you don't see a huge decline in the previous few months, especially January and February, because that's not the con season. Okay. On top of that, you didn't have the pandemic. So, you know, some people submit through the LCS as well. Right. So there's a whole bunch of factors that slow down submission in June. But now the LCS are open. The people that submitted through the LCS, they should be able to get back to normal operation, right? So that's not an excuse on why submission is down. I, other than conventions, I really don't see a huge factor in why submission is down. Now, submission is down across the board, okay? Without the conventions, guess what? You also, you also have a slowdown in signature series, right? I mean, CGC and CBCS are both working hard, having special in-house signing, right? So can you imagine if Todd McFarlane or other creator that doesn't want to do the special in-house signing? Can you imagine how worse the numbers would be okay Whew. okay if you look, if i look at the data and i will slide in more data to show you that the signature series is also suffering significantly just look at the data as far as may and june compared to may and june of last year when the convention seasons are booming big Big changes, right? You're talking thousands, half. The number is cut in half in June without the convention. So yeah, there's a lot of factors that play into, um, you know, why. So ultimately, conventions or lack thereof is a huge factor in, in the decline in submission with CGC. Whether it's in-person submission or yellow label signing. Yeah, I don't see that trend changing anytime soon unless we find a way to kick the virus, right? When it comes down to yellow label, no doubt. Without Stan Lee, that changed a lot of things, right? But I think other creators have picked up the spot. You know, you have Todd McFarlane signing thousands of books. <laughs> and I'm sure other creators will step up. I never say never to John Byrne joining the fray, okay? You, he signed things, but he doesn't work with CGC. But you never know. I don't know his reasoning for not signing, but can you imagine if CGC can somehow coerce him <laughs> into signing oh my god it would explode right so when it comes down to yellow label certainly not having stan lee has an impact 
on that segment of the market but for sure other creators have stepped up right don't you agree anyhow that's my quick thoughts on the market for someone like me who submit books and for those who submit books i'm sure it's a good thing hey instead of waiting three months three weeks yeah <laughs> quicker time to the market right to sell so no complaint from me here that's it for my quick thoughts on the current comic market thanks for watching bye bye